It's with sad news that sound system legend, Ja Shaka has died today. Shaka, also known as Zulu Warrior, has been described as the greatest sound man that ever lived. Shaka was at the helm of sound system culture in London, releasing some of the scene's most seminal records and spearheading the influential Ja Shaka sound system, which he began operating and touring in the 1970s. Born in Clarendon Parish, Jamaica, Ja Shaka, aka Zulu Warrior, whose real name is a bit of a mystery, was a highly respected figure in the reggae community known for his unique style and unwavering commitment to promoting positive messages through music. Having come with his parents to the UK from Jamaica at the age of eight, settling in southeast London Jar Shaka first rose to prominence in the 1970s when he established his own sound system, also called Jar Shaka, which became one of the most influential and enduring sound systems in the UK. With his thunderous bass lines, pulsating rhythms, and powerful lyrics, Ja Shaka created a musical experience that was truly transcendental. The Jar Shaka sound system appeared regularly in London and toured the US, Europe and Japan. He was known for his warrior style of music and kept active in the music scene until the days before his death. A key player in bass culture, Ja Shaka featured in seminal 1980 film Babylon, where he operated his sound system and which portrayed the racial tensions he experienced on arriving in the UK. Ja! Light of this world, I and I, redeemer, 
He stayed true to the spiritual elements inherent within dub and roots reggae even as Jamaican music strayed towards the more lavish colors of dancehall and raga. In a 2014 lecture, Jar said, when people left Africa for the Caribbean, all they could bring with them was their music, their songs, and their memories from home. So, over the years, this is all that people had to keep them together. In the 1950s and 1960s in London, there were house parties, 50, 60 people with only record players. It helped families, no other families, which was important at that time because the people were so forced to be segregated. (laughs) 